My style of cooking is a melting pot of my traditional background in Indian cuisine from growing up in a traditional Gujarati family to my professional background as a chef in my travels from all over the world. So I kept the Tyson Chairman Reserve Pork Tenderloin very simple. I just crusted the outside with fennel and salt. All the flavor that's stemming from this dish comes from the mushroom masala. So that way we could really showcase the flavor of the protein and have this nice accompaniment. To make the mushroom masala, I added some ginger and green garlic and finished with my blend of tandoori masala. In a lot of Indian cooking style, we actually don't pre-toast the spices ahead of time. We bloom them in the cooking process, which actually releases a lot of the aroma and the flavors and really helps kind of transform how we're using these spices and really melt it into the dish. This dish is great because it's something that I would definitely feel proud about putting on one of my menus. It's paying homage to Indian flavors and adding some culinary technique and just being able to create a beautiful dish with a lot of elegance and harmony. I love to blend Indian spices and mix them with other flavors, whether it's a traditional American dish or taking something that I grew up with and kind of reinventing the wheel. So this is a take on a classic sandwich you would find on the streets in Mumbai called a chutney sandwich. To make the masala fried pork loin, I sliced thin medallions out of the Tyson Chairman Reserve pork loin. We seasoned it with the masala blend and salt and soaked it in buttermilk for about an hour. After that, we were able to bread it in flour and then fry it. I think the Tyson's Chairman Reserve Pork Loin is a very approachable cut. I think it's something that has a little bit of fat to it, but it also has a lot of flavor. I love this dish because it's taking both of my roots being born and raised in America and also growing up in a traditional Indian family and bringing them together. And it's showcasing a classic fried pork loin sandwich and merging it with a classic Indian chutney sandwich and showing that there's just epic harmony between the two. This is my take on a traditional shish kebab. Instead of lamb, I used Tyson's Chairman Reserve pork shoulder. It added another element of sweetness to the dish. To complement the sweetness of the pork, I added my own spice blend, including ginger, some green garlic, fresh coriander, and some lemon juice to balance out the flavors. I formed the shish kebabs and then placed it on the grill to get some char to get these nice smoky flavors that you would traditionally get out of a tandoor oven. I did a turmeric stir-fried cabbage consisting of red cabbage, ginger, serrano chili, cilantro, mustard seed, and various spices. It's just a great combination because you have similar spices in the cabbage dish that you have in the shish kebab, upset. There's this contrast in flavor because you have more spice and more fragrance, and then you have this beautiful sweetness that kind of balances the harmony of everything. I love this dish because I think it's just definitely me on a plate. It's kind of all over the place, all these different regions, utilizing all these different beautiful ingredients, but yet it works and it creates a harmony that you wouldn't expect.